Hello friends, in our day to day life, we come across to many shapes like open shapes, closed shapes, simple closed figures and polygons. So, in this video, we are going to study about all this and naming a polygon. But before that, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to it and hit the bell icon so that you get all the notification of the videos which I upload. Let's get started. Now let us first know about the open shapes. What are open shapes? An open shape can be defined as a shape or figure whose line segments or curves do not meet. The shape which do not begin and end at the same point are called open shapes. Have a look at the following shapes. Their end points are not meeting with each other. So all these shapes are known as open shapes. Now closed shapes. In geometry a closed shape can be defined as an enclosed shape or figure whose line segments or curves are connected or meet at a point. They start and end at the same point. Like you can see many figures there, they all are closed shapes. The fun fact about closed shape is, if a shape is closed, we can take a pencil and trace it all the way back to where we started without any breaks. Means, where we start drawing a closed shape, we can end at the same point. So, these kinds of shapes are known as closed shapes. Now, polygons. Polygons are two-dimensional shapes. They are made up of straight lines and the shape is closed. In polygons, all the lines are connected to each other. A polygon is made up of more than two line segments. The line segments that form a polygon are called the sides of the polygon and the intersection of two sides is called a vertex of a polygon where two lines meet that point is known as the vertex of the polygon. Now, let us know a few facts about polygons. Is it a polygon? You can see three figures there. In first figure, all the lines are straight lines. So, this is a polygon. In second figure, one line is a curved line. So, it is not a polygon. While in third figure, the shape is open, so it is also not a polygon. Then we have regular and irregular polygons. Regular polygons have all the lines of same length, while irregular polygons have the lines of different lengths. Then we have simple and complex polygons. Simple polygons are made up of very simple lines. They don't cross each other, while the complex polygons the lines are crossing each other. So, this kind of polygons are known as complex polygons. Now, naming a polygon. It is very interesting to know about naming a polygon. Individual polygons are named according to the number of sides they have. Examples. First, we have triangle which has three sides and three vertices. Then, Quadrilaterals with four sides and four vertices. Then pentagon with five sides and five vertices. Then hexagon with six sides and six vertices. Then heptagon with seven sides and seven vertices. Then we have octagon with eight sides and eight vertices. And nonagon with 9 sides and 9 vertices. And decagon with 10 sides and 10 vertices. And so on. We use polygons at almost every moment of our daily life. From fruits to honeycomb. From floor design to rectangular or square shape buildings. We daily see the traffic signals which can be rectangular, square or triangle in shape. So, I hope you understood this. 
so this is all about the shapes the open shapes the closed shapes and polygons and naming the polygons hope you enjoyed now like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much